Hello Taurus, welcome to a bonus love reading around that time frame. As always, it's a general love reading, so please take what resonates and leave the rest. If this does not resonate at all, that's okay. Just check out my playlist for Taurus. I'll have a link in the description box. There might be a video there that resonates for you. So let's see. Spirit, what does Taurus need to know? Any messages for Taurus? What do they need to know, Spirit? We got two. Inner voice and judgment calls. So there's some sort of decision here that someone's making. And I feel like their intuition is guiding them. Maybe they are trying to figure something out before making this decision. This could be a legal decision, but I'm more than not saying, seeing someone that it's like they're being nudged to make a certain decision here. Um, this could be you or your person. Let's see what this is about. Tell me more for Taurus. Going on for Taurus. When it comes to love. The Fool. Okay. Taurus, you keep having this common theme of a new cycle, a new beginning, a new journey. It just keeps showing up. Seven of Pentacles. And yeah, I feel like a lot of you are wondering how something's going to play out for you. The future of something whether you will have success. I feel like Spirit is constantly reassuring you. But for some reason, here I am doing the same reading. <laughs> so maybe some of you just need to continue hearing it. Queen of Wands. Desire, attraction, creativity. The Queen of Wands is bold. Uh, she is not scared of risks. She is not shy. This might be a bit difficult for Taurus. But I feel like Taurus, you have an inner strength that's very admirable. You are survivors. I feel like um, there's something you want or desire, something that you picture in your mind. Let's see. Why is the fool here? What's this fool about? Why is the fool here? king of wands so this could be in the form of a person there could be somebody new coming into your life Taurus. someone who is um possibly a fire sign um they may be bold attractive charismatic passionate page of wands yes so this could be something that starts and there's like sparks fly there's mutual interest passion omg the tower what is the tower doing here and then bottom of the deck i have justice libra energy and right after that the six of wands very interesting i feel like um a tower needs to happen for this new cycle or this might surprise you the fact that this is something new If there's a tower moment in your life, I feel like it was necessary to write something, uh, bring about some success here with the Six of Wands and the Justice card. This could be something that you don't expect, um, a, a romance that you don't expect, a whirlwind romance, or it could be that um, this tower fell and you probably were worried about the future. And it turned out you didn't have anything to worry about. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? Knight of Swords. Another card of like sudden. Okay, tell me more about the Seven of Pentacles. Page of Swords. What is going on? There's something coming in. Some sort of message. Maybe this is what the decision is about and you're wondering what to do. The sun. This could be good news coming in, Taurus. This could be something that makes you very happy. I feel like you're seeking clarity or perhaps doing research here. Um, this could be just communication back and forth. 
uh, with a, cer a certain person and you're wondering about the future, if there's a future. I feel like this is very open, honest communication here. Tell me about the Queen of Wands. What's the Queen of Wands doing here? Six of Swords. Temperance, Sagittarius energy. This is about seeking balance, harmony, peace. Something that maybe will take a little bit of work. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. This is about balance. I feel like this is what you want. You want something that is fair, equal, balanced. You want something that's peaceful. You don't want to deal with any more drama is what I'm feeling here. You want someone that's willing to give you what you give in return. I feel like you're being careful right now. Not sure why I'm getting that message. Because the fool is not careful. But it's almost like um, whatever decision this is, it's like you want to do the right thing for yourself. I feel like that more, a lot, for a lot of you, this is new a new person coming in. What's next for Taurus? What's next? What's next for Taurus? What's next for what's next? Oh, Six of Pentacles? What's next for Taurus? What's next? Queen of Pentacles? What's next? What's next? Ace of Pentacles. Wow. Amazing. You could be getting an offer of some sort, a new opportunity, Taurus. You keep getting this Queen of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles energy. Uh, I feel like I'm, I'm sounding like a broken record, and I'm sorry for those of you that watch my channel a lot. <laughs> Thank you for your support, by the way, and for always checking back. I'm sorry I don't have any more messages. I feel like this message is just very important. And, you know, I feel like this is a whole new cycle for you. And again, with the broken record, but I feel like you are stepping into something very stable here. This is, this is very stable, calm, successful energy. I got one more for this Ace of Pentacles. Eight of Swords. Yeah, there's some um, hesitancy here. I feel like you're overthinking, and this is what I what I meant when I said earlier. It's like you're trying to be very careful here. Let's see. Let's see if Spirit will give me some insight into your person or what's coming in using my brand new Stellar Rainbow Oracle deck. Spirit, give me some insight into who or what is coming in for Taurus. Because I feel like some of you, this is a job opportunity. And others of you, this is love. Regardless of what it is, you're going to be sitting pretty. Who or what is coming towards Taurus? Who do we need, what do we need to know about who or what is coming towards Taurus, Spirit? What do we need to know? Transformation. Metamorphosis and renewal. Who or what is coming towards Taurus in the near future? Who or what? Definitely a big change for you. Wow. Happy, bright, and cheerful. Look at this. Happy changes, basically, is what this means. Um, and again, I feel like Spirit doesn't really want to tell me this is a person or love specifically. Because I feel like it's different for all of you. I hope that you enjoyed this reading. I'm loving the readings for Taurus recently. Um, I hope that you're enjoying them. If you are, please leave me a comment, hit the like button or subscribe. It really helps the channel grow and it's a free way of supporting the channel. And plus, I just like hearing from you all. So join us at the extent if you like and um, otherwise I'll see you in another video very soon. Take care.